Good morning and welcome to our worship center. I'm so happy to have you here this morning. Let's start out with our greeting. The Lord be with you and also with you. It's so good to have you back here today with us. Let's start out with some of our songs praising God. Let's start out with one of our favorites, Jesus Loves Me. Jesus loves me, this I know, for the Bible tells me so. Little ones to him belong, they are weak but he is strong. Yes, Jesus loves me, yes, Jesus loves me. Yes, Jesus loves me, the Bible tells me so. Very good. How about we try another one of our favorites? Father, I adore you. Father, I adore you. Lay my life before you. How I love you. Jesus, I adore you. Lay do one other one that people always seem to want to sing. Let's get your candles out and let's do a couple verses of This Little Light of Mine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine, let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. Shine it all over the neighborhood. I'm gonna let it shine. Shine it all over the neighborhood. I'm gonna let it shine, let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. Hide it under a bushel, no. I'm gonna let it shine. Hide it under a bushel, no. I'm gonna let it shine, let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. Don't let Satan it out, I'm gonna let it shine. Don't let Satan it out, I'm gonna let it shine, let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. It's so great to praise God with our songs. Now as we're going to get ready to hear Pastor Ben tell us our story, let's work on quieting ourselves and just remembering that we're going to be with God and we can hear him speak to us or maybe we want to take time to speak to him. So let's get ourselves ready with our favorite quieting song. Be still and know that God is here. Be still and Hello friends, today's story is the story of a song of thanksgiving. This week, in a special way, we take time to give thanks. When the people of God gathered for worship, they always took time to give thanks. 
the Lord God rescued his people from slavery in Egypt. He brought them through the wilderness, the dry desert, where there was very little water and food, always just enough. And God's people lived in tents, and they moved from place to place because they were on a journey. God was bringing his people through the wilderness to the land of plenty, the promised land. When God's people arrived in the promised land, they remembered their life in the wilderness. And they looked at the new land of plenty that God had given them, a land in which they had lots of bread and fruits and vegetables to eat, a land in which there were streams of water and wells full of water. And when they remembered their time in the wilderness and they looked at the land of plenty, they sang this song of praise, Psalm 100, which says, Shout for joy to the Lord, all the earth. Worship the Lord with gladness. Come before him with joyful songs. Know that the Lord is God. It is he who made us, and we are his. We are his people, the sheep of his pasture. Enter his gates with thanksgiving, and his courts with praise. Give thanks to him and praise his name. For the Lord is good, and his love endures forever. His faithfulness continues to all generations. We are God's people today, and we give thanks. For the Lord is good. We are his, and his love and faithfulness last forever. I wonder what it was like for God's people to finally arrive in the land of plenty that was their home. I wonder if their time in the wilderness made their new life in the land of plenty even more special and even more sweet. I wonder if their times of thanksgiving were also times when they remembered not just good things to eat and drink, but the sweetness of being with people that they loved. Let us give thanks, for God's love for us lasts forever. Friends, now it is time for us to give thanks to God. You can say something that you are thankful for, or something that you heard in today's story, or something that you are looking forward to today or during the coming week. You may speak your thanks out loud, but you do not have to, because God hears even the thanks that we offer in our hearts. Let's get ready to pray. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right to give thanks and praise. And now, wherever you are, offer your thanks to God in prayer. Lord our God, receive our thanks with grace. Amen. Now, I am going to change the light. The light is all in one place now. 
I'm going to change the light so it's not just one place, but every place. It can be in many places at once. Watch. Now the light of Christ that was just one place is in all times and in all places by the Holy Spirit. So the light can be everywhere in this room and everywhere in the world. It is time for us to go now in peace. Receive God's blessing. The love of God go with you. Go in peace.